Hackers, they're like a dog left alone in your house for more than 10 minutes. They're gonna get into everything and you might find a fun pea surprise on the floor when you get back. So when I tell you that hackers can now hack into your car's computer system, it shouldn't surprise you in the least bit. Um, Lieberman? Yes, generic Valley Girl character? Um, I know how cars work. They have an engine and my computer doesn't have an engine, so. Ah? Well, generic Valley Girl, most modern cars do have computers that run a lot of the vehicle's systems and diagnostics. You know your center display that may or may not be a touchscreen? What about your digital odometer or the sensors that turn your engine warning light on? Look, it may not play Angry Birds, but that's all a specialized computer. Now, to explain what happened, we are going to play the brand new game, Cool or Scary. It's a very exciting, we're excited. Let's play! Wired Magazine writer Andy Greenberg traveled to St. Louis to meet with hackers Charlie Miller and Chris Valasek who wanted to unveil their car hacking skills to the world. Hackers showing off instead of killing or robbing folks? Cool. So Greenberg hops into a Jeep Cherokee and hits the highway with no knowledge of what the hackers were going to do. No knowledge? You don't know these hackers like that, man. Scary. Once on the highway, the Jeep began blasting air on the coldest setting, switched the radio to a hip hop station, and then started slamming ski low at the highest volume. Cool. Can't turn either of those off despite repeated knob twists and button presses. Scary. I like my knobs and my buttons. I want them to work. Picture of the hackers in tracksuits appears on the center console. Cool. Mind you, the hackers are doing all of this from laptops 10 miles away from the vehicle. Super cool. Then the hackers cut the transmission. Scary as hell. The car could barely drive. It couldn't pull over as there was no shoulder on that part of the highway. This wireless automatic automotive auto mayhem code can shut down any Chrysler car thanks to an internet connected computer feature called Uconnect, which controls the entertainment and navigation systems in all their vehicles. Mind you, Chrysler owns a bunch of other companies such as Jeep and Fiat. Think about it. An exploit in Uconnect allows hackers to remotely F your S right up. And it's unknown at this time if any other car makers are susceptible. Scary, scary, cool, scary. Cool, scary, cool, scary, yeah. So now we want to hear from you. Do you think that hackers are going to hack into your car or are you not important enough to be hacked? Let us know down in the comments below. And hey, if you like this video, maybe give it a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't checked out our Facebook page yet, you should absolutely do so. Facebook.com slash SourceFedNews. I'm Matt Lieberman. Thanks for watching. Whether or not reality show star Kylie Jenner's hairstyle is racist and people always ask me if things are racist and I just wanted to say, you're making me look bad. Now I forgot what four times seven was. What did you say? 28, 28. All right, so 288, and I bet 288 times two 